Why would you want a woman to think about you nonstop? I guarantee the minute she starts thinking about you nonstop, and if you are a healthy or healthier man, you will lose the interest in her. Because in order for you to be interested in a woman, you want her to live a separate, autonomous life, to be present where she is with what she is. And then, of course, in the moment of leisure, her mind will swiftly drift to the pleasant thought of you. And that's a totally different thing. So the reason I named my video like that, how to get a woman to think about you nonstop, is because you're actually searching for this topic. But the thing is here is how to get her interested in you in the first place and how to keep that attraction going towards you. That's what we are going to be talking about. I'm going to give you three amazing tips. My name is Katusha, your love and sexuality coach and let's dive in before we begin please hit that subscribe button I love when you like and comment okay let's go number one have a life purpose have something that drives you that makes you tick that makes you get up in the morning something useful that you contribute to this world and to this society and the same by the way goes for her so when two anatomous sovereign universes come together to share their full life experience with each other that is the definition of healthy relationship number two learn how to love i heard it somewhere there are men who know how to love there are men who don't know how to love so this entire channel when aphrodite speaks is dedicated to teach you how to love from your minds from your hearts and from your penises and pussies since this particular video is for men i'm going to teach you how to love us from from female perspective in order for us to open up fully everywhere we need to feel safe we need to feel loved we need to be seen we need to be heard we need to be felt and understood we love when you pursue us pursued by the way should never stop women are much more dependent on context in their love and their sexual desire we know now that men lose their sexual attraction towards their long-time partner like that and women lose their sexual attraction to their long-time partner like that because women are more context dependent of course a woman by the way she is and what she does should inspire you to pursue her both energies are at work and responsible for this dance but pursuit creates the right kind of context for her to keep that desire and that interest burning in her number three responsibility by taking responsibility you turn from a boy into a man your every action your every word has consequences whether you want it or not whether you think about it or not you know since 1960 when the birth control was invented everybody was like whoa sex with no consequences right sex didn't mean now that you had to get pregnant you can do whatever you want women can do whatever they want so it's been 60 years from 1960s and so what have we gotten so far from my personal life living in new york city in my 20s and in my 30s in the time of sex in the city yeah I can have sex, it's empowering, casual sex, meet me in the bathroom kind of thing. Sure, you took care of pregnancy and sexual infections, but there was another aspect that was missing. And it is an emotional side of the things. Over and over again, I would see how people would get hurt. And in my own skin, I would get hurt, right? So we were like, try to separate sexuality for, from the rest of you. And I don't think it's working quite well. So sex is the most powerful emotion a human being can experience. And if you just reduce a person to just that interaction, not care about what that person is really about, the entirety of that person, then you become cold and disconnected. And those of you who are watching and thinking, oh, I just want to have fun, I'm young. Well, ask yourself a question. If you slept with a girl or a boy and you were really into them and that boy and girl didn't respond to you, how did you truly feel? And on the other hand, if you slept with someone and you don't want to hear from them ever again and that person tries to contact you and you ghost them, how do you think that other person feels? Sex always comes with the responsibility. So go ahead and take it. Now, if you want to deepen your connection with yourself to become a sexual master and love master, you can book a free 30 minute phone call with me to discover whether I can help you to expand your 
loving and orgasmic potential. Please check my offerings down below, my free offerings down below, and I will see you very soon. And yes, please subscribe, like, and I love when you comment. Ciao. Where do we go from here to reconnect with